As many of you might already know, Calamity Mod newest update just got released. So far, I've made two videos on Calamity new mecha suit weapons. But I forgot to mention that you can equip RS Exoskeleton mecha arms while you are also using Flamsteed Ring Andromeda mech. This truly feels like a mecha fever dream. Straight from Metal Gear Rising or Evangelion, my childhood dream came true. This interaction is so awesome, I'm literally piloting a gigantic death mech in Truaria, all thanks to Calamity Mod and a friend of mine that told me to try it because he got curious. And naturally, since both of them are endgame weapons, this combo is insanely powerful. No, not just powerful, I call it perfectly balanced. It annihilates everything in game, no seriously, I'm not joking. It makes Dragon Exo Max look like a joke. I think this is the sort of equipment we have to use against Yarim, the final boss of Calamity mod. This literally makes Summoner class the best class on endgame. Also, the update Rework Exoblade. Now it has amazing swing animation, and looks way cooler. It also indirectly buffed it, because the new Exoblade now shoots homing energy beams. Because the old Exoblade beams did not home into enemies. Finally, Exoblade is now usable. And now it has a right click, which makes you dash in the direction of the cursor with the blade that also deals insane damage. The update also added new unique weapons, like Midas Prime, a new gun straight up from Ultra Kill. Try pressing shift while hovering on the weapon, you will see something quite horrific. Use its right click to throw a coin in the air. Hitting the coin with a bullet redirects the shot into the nearest enemy. If you can't aim, just shoot it upwards, but make sure you have lots of money. And yes, it deals more damage if you hit the coin first, so you better practice your aim. Calamity also added a gambling machine gun, the 7 Striker. It has a built-in slots machine which consumes 1 gold coin every time you shoot, so you better bet on your luck to hit jackpot and deal insane damage. Or alternatively, you can use its right click to rapidly shoot coins like a minigun, and yes, it consumes your money. This weapon reminds me of the Team Fortress 2 meme. It costs 5 million dollars to fire this weapon for 10 seconds. There are lots of other new weapons but I don't want to make this video too long so that's it for now, see ya!